right, brother, you're live. You want me to give you a good little introduction? Come on, talk to us, Des, about what you're doing. Yeah, and sure. Let me well, let, let's talk about Des, Des Kutcher. Yeah, he's talking to us about his SMS marketing solutions with local restaurants. We've got Karen Rowland also with us on her, Mark, my friend Mark Z, uh, Zig, Ziegler. And we're going to strategize uh, for a few minutes on how to use SMS marketing to get local restaurants directory, some other amazing things that Des is putting together. And by the way, to proceed, the, excuse me, the proceeds for his WSO that's coming out. When is it coming out, Des? When is your WSO coming? Uh, since, well, in the next 12 days or so, I've got to get out pretty soon because it's got to come out around the time I'm actually doing the charity run, which is the idea that I had in the first And tell run. us so when the charity run is, please. Around, around the 20th of May. Okay. All right, and the 20th of May, and tell us a little bit more about you, Des, to, so the people that don't know you can know what you're passionate about, what you're doing for the charity, and then t and then tell us a little bit more about, you know, obviously about what we came to the call about, but the guy is very passionate about what he does, he's very smart at what he does, and okay, listen okay, to what yeah, he's saying. So, so this is what I'm all about, mobile phones, and how you can turn mobile phones into new customers, and how you can increase customer loyalty with... <clears throat> You know a customer base and i'm very very interested in working with local businesses using mobile and particularly with sms my background is mostly in online marketing and i've done some web development as well um but around last november time i got a product from a guy called dave igo who is absolutely superb marketer and and i i did his thousand uh, dollar a day course with sms uh, marketing and I suddenly fell in love with the whole thing about text marketing. I'd kind of doubled with it for about a year on and off, not really knowing where I was going with it. And suddenly Dave was presenting a very complete strategy for reaching businesses, particularly car dealers and, and estate agents, real estate. And so I've pursued that ever since. So that was last, what, November, I reckon. And what we, at the time of recording this video, this webinar, it's now May. So that's, uh, that's over six months which actually for me is a bit of a record because I have the typical entrepreneur ADD, you know, um, you know seizing opportunities yeah. without necessarily of worrying about the implications <coughs> that come alongside that. But for the first time, I think in my business, and I've been in business for over, just over four years now, I've really settled on something I'm passionate about and really enjoy. And here, here's the simple reasons why I'm passionate about mobile and in particular SMS. The reason why I'm passionate about it is because I strongly believe that every business needs more customers, and yet there are so many solutions out there which don't give them that direct, here's a technique that you can use, here's a tool and a strategy that you can use, which will get you more customers in the next two or three days. Most of the stuff that's out there is all to do with building reputation, which is all needed, building Google love, which is very needed, social media, which is very needed. All those things are very, very important, but they don't give that business that direct sense that this is really working, whereas this does. You know, if I go into a restaurant or a business, or I speak to a business owner at a networking meeting, and that's really where I'm having the greatest success at the moment. If I say to them, here's something you can do right now, and I'm gonna show you the strategy, the single most powerful and effective strategy I've been using in the last three networking meetings that I've been to, if I can go to these business owners, these decision makers who hold the budgets, who are the only ones qualified to spend money rather than save money for the business, if I go to them and say, this is what we can do, then they're going to want to talk to me. And that's, that's been my exact experience over the last few weeks that I've been doing this. And I'm kind of getting to the stage now where I'm seriously thinking I've got to outsource my business so I can actually make good on what I'm promising to deliver. Because the worst thing you can do is uh, grow too quickly when you don't have infrastructure in place. So, so what I want to share with you today is some of those things that I'm doing and where I'm aiming at and how that can translate for you in your situation. Because obviously we're all in different places, we've got different experience, we've got different things that make us uh, itch where we're scratching or scratch where we're itching. And so I'm only sharing my perspective and what's working for me. And a little bit of a backstory before I get into the particular strategy that I'm enjoying using at the moment. It's something that Frank, Frank Kern uh, released recently to his list. And it's something that he calls the PVT uh, formula, sorry, the PVP formula. And he, he says, you know, if you just Google Frank Kern PVP, you'll find it. It's a training video on 
what you should be doing and why you should be doing it. And for the first time ever, I actually found an internet, an online and offline marketer, i.e. Frank Kern, who was actually preaching something that I desperately needed to get affirmed by in my uh, entrepreneur of ADD. And the PVP stands for personal satisfaction. You've got to have a lot of personal satisfaction out of what you're, what you're doing. It's got to make you tick. It's got to make you excited. And the second thing, the V, it's got to give value to other people. So they've got to really appreciate what you're doing. And the third letter, the final P, is profitability. It's got to be something that makes you money and makes the business money that you're serving. So if you can find that sweet spot of those three things, you have to personally assess on a score of 1 to 10 what your PVP value is with what you're doing. Then if you can get to 30, then you know you're on a winner. And I strongly believe, for me personally, my PVP score for text marketing is, a, is around 30 because I know that I'm going to get a huge kick out of doing this. Every time I've been doing this, I've just thoroughly enjoyed myself. The value to the business is huge because... You know, it's something that's very tangibly going to increase their customer base very quickly if they do it right and if they follow what I'm going to teach them. And obviously, it's profitable for them and it's going to be profitable for me. And I want to acknowledge one other marketer who's really influenced me directly um, in the recent months. Um, in fact, end of February, a guy called Chris Winters. If you Google Chris Winters, um, I don't know, Chris Winters uh, mobile, Chris Winters marketing. Uh, Winters as in Winters and Chris as in Chris, then you'll find uh, an amazing story of a guy whose life was in ruins, who turned his life around within a sh very short space for two years. And now he's giving back. He's giving back in so many different ways. And one of the things he gave back to me was he showed me a strategy at the end of February from one of his training videos that I got. I think it's from Anthony Ayer's uh, mobile snatcher course. Chris Winters had a strategy in there. It was 42 minutes of solid training on how to really just excel with serving restaurants and SMS marketing. And that's the strategy that I've been basing or wanting to work on over the last, well, two months, really, since I found out about that strategy. And out of that has come this desire to create this uh, product called SMS for Restaurants. And what I'm going to be doing in that is sharing Chris's strategy, sharing my initial results with that, and then that's going to be an ongoing training program. So once people join that training program, they get it for life. There's not going to be, uh, you know, there's not going to be any add-ons to that product. It's going to be one product for life with a Skype membership, obviously, and a, and a membership site as well. And in fact, I've been what I've been doing for the last five or six weeks is I've formed a, a small cluster of about 40 people who purchased. Uh, SMS Magi, which is a, a simple product that I'm now using white labeling for realtors and for, um, you know, for car dealers. And basically all the people who purchased that product, over 500 people purchased that product, 40 of them have uh, joined me in this strategy for reaching restaurants with mobile, including some of the people on the call today, which I really appreciate you being here. So, um, so in essence, what the strategy involves is what the, the strategy that Mike Koenigs, another great online and offline marketer, particularly with video, he recommends, and that's the results in advance strategy, and that's what Chris recommends too. It's where you get the business a result in advance, and as a result of that, you then do business with them. And with text messaging, it's a very tangible result because you can almost feel it because, you know, you can send, you can get it so that whenever somebody gets a new lead coming into their business, you can get it so that a message goes to their mobile phone so they can see it happening in, in action. Now, I'm at the moment still working on the strategy that works best for the businesses. But in terms of getting to the business owners and the decision makers, I've got a strategy which I'm absolutely loving at the moment, and that's using good old-fashioned traditional networking groups.